Hey y'all, welcome back. I got a Ross haul for y'all. Y'all, I've been down in the dumps for the last couple days. <sighs> yeah. But anyway, I got up today. I said, let me go on a, a little Ross spree. So let me see what's going on. I haven't been there. Well, lying. <laughs> I was just there last week. But I didn't wasn't going there to shop for. I was just going there to shop for a rug. So I picked up a couple things. I had showed y'all this um this uh oil that I got my, for my hair. I like it. It's biotin. Anyway, ain't I jumping to the point? Y'all, I was supposed to have put this tour up. I just ordered some more daylight bulbs. You see that I got a brighter light in this room than I do anywhere else. Everything else is dull. Anyway, they'll be here tomorrow between four and eight. <laughs> That's about the best I could do. Cause every, I, this is the worst place for lighting that I've ever lived in my life. You can't get lighting. I only have a few windows on this side. Everything else is no windows. I got windows in the bedroom, windows right here and windows in the guest bedroom. And that's it. There's no other lighting. There's no skylights. So I needed to change every light bulb in here. And that over on that side has to get done with the daylight bulbs before I could finish the tour because it just was looking bad like all the other ones did. So anyway, I'm gonna take it tomorrow morning. But I'm gonna show, you know what? As a matter of fact, let me show y'all the little quick snippet. I'll show you a little quick snippet of this area and you'll see the difference in the lighting. Okay, so I'll do a tour, you know, like actually tour and show y'all stuff um, tomorrow when them bulbs come tomorrow morning so I can get better lighting. But anyway, this here is Pro Growth Hair Oil. oil. I, something was going on, either it's with my age or hormones or something, but my hair has been falling out like crazy for the last like year and a half. Um... And it's super thin right now, so that biotin oil is working. The only thing is my hair and oil don't mix. So I really can't do much with it. And the pulling it back doesn't help br the breaking, like right in here. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm probably just going to be using this stuff as hot oil treatment. But I got this Pro Growth Oil. Is it by the same brand as that biotin? I'm going to mix them and do them like uh, heat it up in a microwave or, you know, like in a, on a, something on the burner and then I'll um do scrub my you know rub my and massage my scalp for five ten minutes and then I'll wash it after about an hour or two because that's the directions on here anyway or you can put it in and leave it in but I can't leave it too long but anyway I'm gonna do this on my I'm talking too much so I got that y'all I was like I'm just gonna get me some that was it I didn't think about this house I didn't think about nothing but I got some dish detergent. I didn't get Dawn because I didn't feel like going into the regular store. This is uh, Peppermint Lemon, Rebel Green, Super Deluxe. It's very watery. But I needed some. Y'all, I done, th through my little depression, <laughs> I was in it. I was in it, y'all. I don't even know why because there was no reason for it. But I think doing a lot of work on yourself tends to bring in negative feelings. And you got to just work through them. And that's what I did. So... Yeah, I didn't even barbecue. Oh, that smells good. I didn't even barbecue on uh, Labor Day. Nope. Didn't even eat. So, um, yeah. But I'm getting it together. I'm, I'm doing much better. So, anyway, I got Clorox foaming cl uh, glass cleaner. I needed glass cleaner bad. Last I showed y'all, I had to mix lemon last time. I meant lemon. Um, vinegar in my little bit I had left. Because <laughs> I needed some. And then I got this. Hair um, conditioner and shampoo. This was $15.99. And I didn't even look up the price. It says $26 on here, but if you look on Amazon, this is probably like $40, $45, bucks, I bet you. So I got, um, it's by BJ, no, SJ Beauty Co. 
So um, replenishing castor oil conditioner and replenishing castor oil shampoo. I'm going to try it because I got to do anything to bring my hair back. I got to get this head back together. Then I got these for the kitchen. I did buy something for the house. I got these because in my reorganizing the cabinets, I took out all my spices and everything out of one cabinet and I stocked it with dishes. Um, I put dishes in different cabinets in there so I could easily get to them better. And I'm going to utilize my pantry better. I'm getting ready to purchase a pantry, a tall with closed doors that I could close off because I got a lot of glassware and I want to use a section or two for some spices. But I'm reorganizing, getting stuff out of my way. So I got two of these. These were $3.99 at uh, Ross. Oh, I didn't even tell y'all how much the hair stuff was. Did I? This was... $4.99, like the other one. Like I said, I got this one, but the biotin one. So I got to get my hair back. And then this right here was $2.99 for the dish soap. I got to get some Dawn in my life. That's what I really need. And then this glass cleaner was $2.49. So I probably could have got this at uh, Walmart or Dollar Tree don't sell Clorox brand, I don't think, but... I didn't need Clorox brand. I just got what they had because I didn't feel like going nowhere else. Here's the other one. So I got two more of these storage containers. Because like I said, in clearing out those cabinets, some of the ones that I couldn't find the lid or might have been discolored, I was pitching them. I could not, I can't hold on to it. Okay, then I got one more thing. Well, one of four. Y'all look what they had. They had Lysol kills 99.9% of the virus, it's viruses and bacteria. 80 wipes for $3.99. Y'all, they had four. Guess who got four? <laughs> I took them all. I took them all. Yes, I got my Clorox wipes back. I haven't been able to find Clorox wipes since the pandemic hit. Yes, the brand, real Lysol, I mean, not Clorox, but Lysol brand. These are my favorite. Lysol um, disinfectant wipes. That's my favorite one. So I got all four of them. Sorry, not sorry. Everybody else was stealing them before. So, kills colds and flu viruses. Yeah, they're mine. So, I got four of those. And they were $3.99. I haven't seen them like that in a long time. So, yeah. If I go to another Ross in the next couple days, I'm going to be looking for them. And not that I like to stack up too much, but, hey, it is what it is. All right. So, you know, I had to, when I'm feeling down, I got to buy some clothes. Sorry, do. These are Old Navy Rockstar. I love these. These are a size eight um, because my size tens are way too big in these jeans. They, I've never found any at Ross. I've always found them at Old Navy. I like Old Navy's brand, but these were $7.99 at Ross, look. And I want to say these run like 40 bucks, 40 some odd bucks. And then you can catch them on sale at Old Navy. After that, they got a little distressing at the knee. They are a, um, now I do have a pair of blush jeans, but they're a size 10 and they're a little too big. So I got these to replace them. They got a little distressing in the leg a little bit and they're cute. And these are gonna take me through fall. And then I found, let me just show you the jeans first. I found these jeans. These were $14.99, I wanna say. Yeah, $14.99. I don't know the brand, but they're just a Ross brand. These are called Super Soft Rayon Denim by Bamboo. They're size nine. And they got a little distressing too, you see? And then on the back too, just on the pocket there and then down at the bottom. So they're cute. These will tuck in boots good. And they're cute. I just got, you know, because a lot of my jeans are just too big. So I'm running around with everything on too big. And then I got one more pair of jeans. I got these. in a darker blue. So I got the pink, the, like a blush pink, light blue. And now, yes, I got a whole lot more. But a lot of them are just way too big. So I went and got the size down like I should have. Like the size I wear. These got a little distressing and cuffs. And again, they'll fit cute in boots. Or, you know, whatever you want to wear casual or you could throw on a heel with them or whatever, right? And that's a little more of a dressy because it's a little darker. <laughs> that's the way I look at it. I'm old school. Okay, then I found this, and this was on clearance. There's my receipt. 
this was uh, oh those dark blue jeans these were $14.99 too the only ones that was $7.99 was that blush paint then I got $9.99 for this this is by who I don't know y'all tinsel I don't know I've never heard of this brand the Ross brand. This is a size medium. This was on clearance for $9.99. But it's a thicker material, right? It's a cute sleeve. So look at that. Butterfly sleeve, right? And it comes down at the bottom and kind of flares. It's like a butter butterfly shirt. All in like this um, rusty color. I told y'all these are my colors. Now, look at this. If I want it to be daring, this will go good with this, right? with the blush pink with this salmon -y color, right? That's cute if I just wanted to go neutral or I could wear with either of these other jeans and it'll still go nice. Depend, you know, throw on a pair of boots, similar natural color boots. So that's what I was doing. Again, this can go with these or the dark blue jeans, right? See that print? Oh, I told y'all that shirt was $9.99. I was cleaning up. This one was $12.99. It wasn't on clearance, but it was $12.99. Wait a minute. Yeah, $12.99. But again, a big oversized for the, you know, colder weather. It has a hood, right? And this camo. And I got, Lord knows I got enough to go with this, right? This is size medium by A-E-R-I-E. -E. I know that store used to be in the mall. I don't know what it is. Ari or something. But it's just a big old sweatshirt with the hood on the back. For cold days and I don't wear feel like wearing a jacket y'all know those um shirt jackets that's out they're calling them shackets or something like that shacket or or yeah I think if they're calling them shackets or something I don't know but I just recently got one because I got another bunch of stuff coming in from um not bunch but I got like five pieces coming in from a uh, two with sets as a set pants and a sh in the top and then I got one of these shacket things coming in from Forever 21. I ordered those over the Labor Day weekend. And here's another, just throw on, cute. Look, imagine this with those dark jeans, right? And a cute pair of the, my blue boots that I had got a couple months ago. You can roll the sleeves up or you can let them down. It has a hood on it, right? And then it has the elastic at the waist. See, so it's just not elastic, but a, a drawstring and a little pocket in the front. So it's like a sweatshirt slash, um, a sweatshirt slash, um, cause it's a pullover, right? You see that it's a pullover with the, just the buttons right up to come to where your breast area is. Then it has the pocket around your waist, like right in your midsection. What is this? A sweatshirt slash lumberjack shirt, flannel. And then... I got this flannel-ish. It's not necessarily flannel because the fabric isn't flannel, but it gives you that plaid throw on. Now, again, this has navy blue and gold in it, right? Those navy blue jeans I just showed y'all. With this, a tank or t-shirt like underneath of it for layering. I told y'all how Texas is. Again, the three-quarter length if you want to roll it up to or drop it. T-shirt underneath, cute. Fall into, uh, like, well into December. Only month, like, I will wear this even through the whole winter in, um, here in Texas. But, like, January, most days, I probably will put on a jacket or something with it. But, um, you know, unless there was a cool day. But, again, look at this. I got to get me some t-shirts, but I'm going to Walmart for that. Look at that. Ain't that cute? Now, I will wear either this goldish color t-shirt or a navy blue t-shirt and put it on right with that, with my cute boots. And then here's another one. But I got this one because I have these camo tights that has these colors in it. I never wore them. And I just noticed them when organizing the drawers. That's what depression does to me. It makes me organize. I've been organized. I need to have, have been in that closet, but I wasn't that depressed. I didn't get there yet. But I'm going to get that depressed to get into my closet and get that organized. But um, look at this. I don't even know where this is going to go because I don't have no room to hang it nowhere <laughs> or or put it in a drawer anymore. I, I don't have no room, y'all. But I'm going to find some because I'm going to get rid of some stuff. But, yeah, look how big and um, loose this will be on the, with the tights or either jeans. Again, 
That's what I'm doing this year, y'all. Really relax. And then the last thing I got was this sweatsuit. Look at this. It's got pink and gray and white. And it's in a, like a tie-dye. It's just a big old throw-on, slouchy um, sweatpants. And this is cropish. However, I put it up to me. It comes down below my waistline. So I would throw a t-shirt on underneath of this, right? And Like in a pink and kind of let it tuck a little longer than this shirt. But this, the, this is cropish, but it comes to like right below my stomach area, right at my hip area. Yeah, so I got this. And here's the, this is the shirt that goes with that. But yeah, y'all, that's what I was doing. Um, like I said, I stuck that little snippet of just this area in the living room so you can see the rug and everything. But as soon as the daylight bulb, those bulbs over there are horrible. It's horrible. Look, at, I'm gonna see if I can spin y'all. Look at this. I got stuff on, ignore the stuff on the refrigerator. I'm organizing, I told y'all. But you see that yellow in the lights right there, the hang there? It's horrible. And then you come back and everything is just a mess, you know? So yeah, I'm organizing. Now, taking the food out of here, so I set it up there so I could, uh, but those cabinets now are full of dishes. I don't have no more food in those cabinets. Cleaned them all out, did that. So you guys will see that and it'll be back to normal. I could put my organizing card away and then do the video again tomorrow at uh four and then i'll be done in here and that way i really don't touch in here if i'm not moving stuff around i really don't touch in here so all i have to do from now on is just come in here and dust because i'm i'm not decorating for the holidays i told y'all maybe the christmas tree but other than that um yeah i'll be done in here and um i got a few more things over there that has to go to storage and um yep that's what that's what I'm doing, y'all. I'm gonna put this stuff away. Fold these sheets right here. I got an, another. Just I think that's just one in two pillowcases. So put that away. That's another thing I did, y'all. I went in there. The section I have, I have this chest of drawers that's full of my sheets and stuff. I got rid of stuff that I did not need anymore. I kept one set of gray, one set of multicolored gray, and like four sets of white. Everything else had to go. So that's the last of me rewashing and folding and putting everything back in there. Yup. I've been in here getting rid of stuff, y'all. I've been in here throwing, pitching, getting rid of everything. So, um, yeah. Uh, after I finish in here in this kitchen with those cabinets on that side and putting that food in the pantry, I'm done. So, and then I gotta, like I said, my bathroom and my closet has to be organized. So I'll be getting that done. But yeah. All right, y'all. I'm going to chit-chat with y'all later. I'm alive. But, yeah, I just had a couple down days, y'all. Had a couple down days. Coming back from it. And, um, hey. <laughs> I, can't, I can't fix it. I can't tell y'all no more. I'm trying my hardest, though. I really am. You know, it's like we're all human, and sometimes we just have that time. There's no explanation. Nothing wrong. It's just it is what it is. All right, y'all. I'm going to chit-chat with y'all later. Thanks a lot for watching. Um, I'll try to get to the comments tonight. All right, y'all. No, wait a minute. I got my clicker right here. Why well, I'm going to get up. <laughs>